Hi everyone, this is part two of the Kona Trails by the Ocean here in the Big Island of Hawaii. Last vlog was in Aliyah Drive, the main hub of Kona. It's also called the Royal Byway. Let's tackle some more of those trails. No one can touch me now. The Kona Community Center, depending on where you're staying at, the walk to the community center is relaxing. And when you arrive there, there are like playgrounds, baseball field, basketball courts, tennis courts. Then through the community center is a hidden pathway to the shoreline. Uh, the walk is along the residential area, so please respect their privacy. But you can walk there, uh, bring your swimsuit. If you want, you have access to the beach. Uh, it's about 1.9 kilometers to about two mile round trip. So this is the community center, also called Kailua Park, Old Airport. Oh, okay. And voila, you'll see the ocean. So this path here goes through a residential area, but you can walk along this pathway. You can turn right. And that goes towards Makeo walking path. And where the airport is, that's to the north. Or you can turn left and that goes to the downtown area. This is the Makea Walking Trail, part of the Kailua Kona Old Airport Walking Path, which is north of the community center. 
Um, it is for hiking, swimming, surfing, and picnics. It's about two miles or 1.9 kilometers round trip. Uh, people do a couple of laps because the walk is adjacent to the Pacific Ocean. It's very relaxing as well. So you'll see a lot of locals here for various activities, picnicking, surfing, swimming, and even meditating, which I saw last night. That's all for now everyone. My advice to everyone is all of the Kona trails by the beach are not shaded so these trails are all early morning hikes. Um, it can be brutally hot during summertime so if you hike later. Otherwise use that sunscreen, bring your hat and water, don't forget your swimsuit. Um, since these trails have beaches, well most all of them are beaches um, in the end that are all accessible for swimming. Um, maybe surfing too. So remember, respect the residents. The, islands has, the island has transfer way stations where the residents and visitors dispose of their garbage accordingly. Um, I mean, if you are a visitor here, there's also some garbage cans around, but they have a transfer waste. They actually leave their garbage there and recycling. So um, be a part of saving the world, even though we think it would only be small, but you know it all adds up so stay safe everyone i will see you in the next vlog for part three of the kona ocean trails no